trip behind the scenes With future country rock blues kings and queens Discover them first With Palm Bash TV Palm Bash TV Well, hello there. It's Paul Mash TV time again. Thank you so much for joining us on another episode. We've got a great interview coming up for you in just a moment. But before we get into that, don't forget to click that subscribe button and hit the bell. And every time we get a new interview, you'll be notified. And be sure to use the comment on the comment section to talk, tell us what you think. And on Facebook, go to facebook.com forward slash Paul Mash TV and feel free to like the page, inboxes, comment and things there. And uh, also, you can email us. It's uh, palmashtv, all one word, at gmail.com. And if you're a band or a solo artist, you can use that, obviously. But we love fan mail there, too. So leave us a fan letter, and we'll get back to you as quickly as we can. And all this will be recapped at the closing credits at the end of the show, so stay tuned for that. From Los Angeles, California, we have Jasmine J. Walker today. And if you recall, uh, we had a Heather Walker on our show just the other day. That's her mother. And she's also a talented artist as well. And we'll get to that in just a second, but here's a quick word from the Smile World TV. So don't go away. We'll be right back. types of shows we're seeking. Let us help you share your creativity. For more information, email us at smilepublishing007 at gmail.com or you can visit our website swtvgetyourchannel.now.site. All right, everybody. It's interview time as promised. And with us from Los Angeles, California, we'll have Jasmine J. Walker. Thanks for joining us, Jasmine. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so excited um, to meet with you today. Yeah, well, we're glad to have you. And uh, for those of you that remember, just a few days ago, we interviewed Heather Walker. Uh, this is her daughter right here. And she's also a talented singer. And we're glad to have her on, on today. Uh, uh, tell us a little bit about how you began. I mean, did it start with your mother or did, did was there other reason that caused you to be an artist? Uh, let us know your story. Yeah, I think just naturally for me, um, being as though my mom, you know, is a singer and then my dad was also a musician, I just kind of naturally flowed into the, the music world. So I've been performing, you know, for a long time since I was a little girl, I would say as early as maybe eight years old. I did a lot of church plays and, you know, singing in the choir. And as I was coming up in school, I was singing in the choir and doing plays and stuff like that. Um, so I just naturally kind of fell into music because my mom, she was touring, she was doing background for a bunch of people. So I just naturally kind of took an interest to singing. Um, and then my, my family are, you know, heavy singers, you know, on my dad's side, my grandmother is a pastor and she sings. So I was singing at her church. And then my mom's dad is also a pastor and my grandmother sings on that side of the family. So it's just, it was a natural progression for me um, but I didn't start really recording until like around high school time that's when I really took my music more seriously oh okay well, well that's good and uh, I'm glad you're doing what you're doing and I, I know your mom's proud of you for uh, taking the music career too I'm sure <laughs> okay. um, uh, what were some of your influences growing up and uh, you know that uh, influenced you to be an artist uh, I know your mom gave me a few but I'm sure you have a few of your own <laughs> Yeah, um, my influences are, you know, uh, heavily, you know, gospel influence. So the Clark sisters, um, Hezekiah Walker, Kurt Franklin, of course. But in the rap realm, I would say Lauren Hill. I would say Eve. Um, people like um, Nicki Minaj and uh, Missy Elliott. I just love how creative they are. Um, and they inspired me growing up, you know, especially Lauren Hill, listening to her and, you know, just for me, you know, I grew up in, in Jersey and spent a lot of time in Brooklyn. And so just to hear those influences from there, that really inspired me to want to rap and to 
to know that it was okay to be a woman, you know, rapping and rhyming and, you know, going outside of the box and just being super creative. Um, so those were my main influences then and um, even more so now. And, you know, like pe people like um, Biggie Smalls and Nas and, you know, the whole rap scene, that's, that's really who I, I always look to for influences and for inspiration you know, in terms of rap, but in terms of vocal ability, it's definitely going to be gospel influence, but also people like Jill Scott, Erica Baidu, people who are very poetic, flowetry. Um, so yeah, those are a little bit of, of who I'm inspired by and who, you know, I really look to just for inspiration in general. Yeah, no, those were some great artists you just mentioned right there, and I, I can definitely see where you get their uh, style from and everything. Yeah. Um, where, where can we find your music at? I mean, I'm sure it's in all streaming platforms, but I don't know if you have physical copies like CDs, but you can volunteer that as well. I'm sure everybody out there would love to know. Right. So right now my music is streamed, uh, is distributed um, digitally. So you can find it everywhere. It's most, um, right now where it's at the most is Spotify, Apple Music. You can find it on YouTube. You can find it on Amazon Music. Um, if you have Tidal, you can find it on Tidal. Um, it's also on Shazam. So I'm really pretty much everywhere. Um, but yeah, it's, it's only streamed digitally for right for right now. Um, but I think when I start going like touring and different things like that, I'm probably going to have like CDs and USB cards with the music on it. Um, but for right now, since we're still kind of virtual, <laughs> my music is, is um, on the online platforms. Okay. Well, I know I would, she would really be happy if you went to all those streaming platforms and download uh, Jasmine Jane Walker's music. So I uh, hope you'll do that today. And uh, we got a song here, uh, Believe, I guess is the name of the song. Uh, I'm sure it's self-explanatory, but tell us a little story about the song. Yeah, this, this is like the first song that I recorded um, post, I would say, middle school. Because in middle school, like I used to battle rap people and I wrote two songs and I recorded those songs, but throughout high school, I never really recorded anything. So this was the first song that I wrote just out of college. Um, I didn't feel inspired. I kind of felt like, you know, I have this gift, but am I really talented? So when I got the beat for this song, I just felt so led to write these lyrics to inspire myself and to encourage myself to just believe, you know, believe that if there's something that you're thinking about all the time, every day, then that means you're meant to do it, you know? And so this was my way of just encouraging myself. And I have had such a great response for this song so many people have said that it's inspired them and so I'm very proud of the work that I did with this song and um I'm very happy that it's inspiring so many people so check out my song believe um and the video was fun to shoot we shot it in New York which is where I'm from so I'm, I'm happy that you know you guys are going to get to check that out yeah, and it is a great song, and I hope it inspires a lot of you out there as well. And uh, and I guess that's all the time we have for right now, Jasmine. We thank you so much for coming on the show. Uh, we'd love to have you back again sometime if you have anything to do to plug for us. Yeah, absolutely. I have a, um, a new EP coming out. Um, it's going to be coming out around Thanksgiving time. Um, but for right now, you guys can check out my song, Believe. I have a song called Heavenly Favored off of my new EP, Black Butterfly. I also have a, a EP out right now called Chasing Freedom. Um, and it's under uh, Artless. So if you if you make YouTube videos out there and you need royalty free music, check out Artless. They're a great uh, uh, distribution company for artists. So thanks again. I appreciate you guys for tuning in. And again, you know, stay inspired and believe you guys, believe in your dreams. <laughs> Okay, well, here it is, Believe by uh, Jasmine J. Walker here on Paul Mash TV. Don't go away. We'll be back in a second.
No more making excuses for my own shortcomings It's time to take responsibility for me Daughter of a king who's king of all kings So, um, yeah, I've been top tier Walking with my head held high in every stride I make I took the long way here, my soul you can't take No matter what you're saying, do my spirit can't break Real self-love is kinda hard to fake So love yourself, little girls and boys Don't let this big bad world swallow up your joy Cause they ain't give it to you, now that's God's work Amazing things you will achieve when you put them first I can't I will Of a champ, cause I am that funny when I profess my dreams. People fell back. Ah. They all thought I was crazy. crazy. What crack you smoking? I think your vision's hazy. hazy. Girl, you must have fell in above your head. Did your mama drop you as a child? I think you lost your mind. Nah, ain't no loose screws here. You talking to a woman that moves with no fear. fear. I wanted something different, so I did something different. Yeah. I saw it, believed it, spoke to God, and achieved it. Yeah, this for every train ride that I ever had to cry to see my dreams thrive. So you wanna get in the mix of God, God's plan? Yeah. Well, bless your heart, honey, good luck with that. With if that. it's one thing I know, can't nobody stop my back, cause what's meant for me, best believe I have. I can and I will achieve every single dream as long as I believe. What's going on? Honestly, things are going amazing. I never thought this could be possible for me. It's just everything is going so well. Jasmine, didn't I tell you anything was possible when you just believed? You know what's so crazy? Like, even if this never would have happened, this big break, I still think that all the hard work I put in to build myself up was worth it. And I just want to say I'm so grateful to you. Thank you for believing in me. No, Jasmine, thank you for believing in yourself. 